everyone, I'm Kyla from Zuzuro and this here is Frito. And today we're gonna be talking about the different types of bedding, which ones are safe for chinchillas, and which one suits you and your chinchilla the best. Before we start, make sure to come check us out. We have tons of high quality products made by pet lovers just like you. Check out the link in the description below to get 10% off your first purchase with our special YouTube viewer code. All right, let's get started. When it comes to bedding, there are a lot of choices to choose from. And unfortunately, some of these choices are not safe for chinchillas. Unsafe bedding are bedding such as cedar, which can cause respiratory infections, or mixed wood shavings, which also contain cedar. You also don't want to give your chinchilla cat litter, synthetic bedding, or carefresh paper bedding, because chinchillas will commonly try to eat these types of beddings. If your chinchilla does eat these kinds of beddings, then it can cause impactions or blockages in your chinchilla's digestive tract. Regular blockages chinchillas can pass, but if it's an undigestible material that your chinchilla has eaten, then it will not be able to pass this very easily, which means that you will want to take your chinchilla to the veterinarian, because otherwise, without treatment, impactions are often fatal. Luckily, there are some chinchilla-safe beddings that you're able to use. These beddings are kiln-dried pine, aspen, and fleece liners. Pine and aspen shavings are good to use for chinchillas because they're very absorbent and you can easily spot clean their chinchilla's cage every day. The only cons with pine and aspen shavings are that they can easily fall out of your chinchilla's cage and make a mess on the floor and the surrounding areas. They've been, both been known to be very dusty and you would have to make frequent trips to the store to purchase more bedding. On the other hand are fleece liners. Fleece liners are reusable, washable, and customizable. You also don't have to go to the store because you ran out of bedding. The only con with fleece liners is that you're going to want to remove any of the excess hay or feces on the liners so that your chinchilla doesn't walk on them. You can easily do this with a vacuum or a handheld broom. Another thing to keep in mind is that you're probably going to want two sets of liners. This is because while one liner is washing, you have the other liner to go inside of your chinchilla's cage so that your chinchilla isn't walking on a hard plastic or wiring. Or alternatively, if you only have one liner, you can easily be washing that while you have your chinchilla out for playtime. Make sure to wash your fleece liners at least one time per week. If you're wanting to get fleece liners for your chinchilla's cage, we have both the single and double level liners for the Critter Nation or Ferret Nation cages. The link for those can be found in the description below. I hope that you are able to learn more about what type of bedding suits you and your chinchilla's needs. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, make sure to hit that thumbs up button down below and subscribe for more critter content. It really helps us out. Thank you guys so much again and I'll see you in the next video.